Hey there, it's Amelia from Sleepopolis, and today we're gonna to be talking about not one, not two, but five different Tempur-Pedic pillows. These are the five most popular models that the brand offers, and I have tested every single one of them. So in this video, I'm gonna compare them all and help you figure out which one's best for you. I'm a certified sleep science coach and I review new sleep products every single week, so I'm ready to give you all the lowdown on what these pillows feel like, what they're made of, and who they're gonna be best for. But before we get started, make sure you subscribe to our channel for lots more reviews and sleep content. All right, let's get started. All right, first things first, let's go over the buying policies for all of these Tempur-Pedic pillows. Now keep in mind, these policies only apply if you buy directly from Tempur-Pedic, as you can buy these pillows from some third-party retailers like Bed Bath & Beyond. So if you buy from there, be sure to check their fine print. All right, so first things first, Tempur-Pedic offers free shipping within the contiguous United States on all these pillows. Customers in Hawaii, Alaska, Puerto Rico, and other US territories will have to pay an additional shipping fee. Also, these pillows do not ship compressed. Next, Tempur-Pedic does not offer a sleep trial on any of these pillows, so they can only be returned if they're damaged or defective when you receive them. Finally, Tempur-Pedic offers a five-year warranty on all these pillows. So for our first pillow, let's talk about the Temper Cloud pillow. Now, this is a pretty simple pillow. It's made with a polyester knit cover and a core of Temper material foam. Now, Temper Material Foam is Tempur-Pedic's proprietary memory foam that they use in most of their mattresses and their pillows. I found the Temper Cloud to have a pretty medium firmness. The foam allows for lots of contouring and deep sinking in, but still offers good support. And I was surprised to find that it was comfortable in every sleeping position, side, back, and stomach. So this is a great option for combo sleepers. But with a medium loft of five inches and a medium firmness, I'd say I'd recommend it most highly to back sleepers. As a back sleeper myself, I found the Temper Cloud to be super comfy. However, being a memory foam pillow means that the Temper Cloud does trap heat pretty easily. The foam is able to mold around you by absorbing your body heat, so this may not be the best option for hot sleepers. It's also not a good choice for anyone who likes a pillow that's malleable and fluffable as the core is a solid block of foam. Now currently this pillow costs $89, but prices do change a lot, so make sure you go over to sleepopolis.com to see the most up-to-date pricing information, as well as find some exclusive coupons, or if you're feeling lazy, you can just find those in the YouTube description. Next up, let's talk about the Temper Neck Pillow. Now seemingly this pillow is quite similar to the Temper Cloud, as it's made with a polyester knit cover and a Temper material core. However, the core of the Temper Neck is molded into a wavy shape that's meant to follow the natural curvature of the body. The foam is also significantly firmer than that of the Temper Cloud. But even being a firm pillow, it does allow for a little bit of contouring. This unique shape allows for the larger part of the pillow to provide neck support while the dip lets your head rest comfortably. It's important to note that this pillow is only designed for side and back sleepers. As I'm sure you can guess, stomach sleepers wouldn't find this comfortable at all. I tried it out sleeping on my stomach just to be sure, and honestly, I felt like the firm curved foam was choking me a little bit, so definitely no. But I did find the Temper Neck to be really comfortable for both back and side sleeping. The Temper Neck comes in three different sizes to ensure the ergonomic shape works for all body sizes. To figure out which size is best for you, you'll want to measure the distance between your neck and your shoulder. Tempur-Pedic has a chart that tells you which to choose based on this measurement and your sleeping position, which you can find by clicking the Temper Neck link in the description below. Like the Temper Cloud, the Temper Neck isn't great for hot sleepers, as its memory foam core will also trap heat. And if you're not a fan of firm support, you might not like this ergonomic design. Right now, the Temper Neck pillow costs $109 for a small size, $119 for a medium size, and $149 for a large size. Next up, let's talk about the Temper Symphony pillow. This pillow is also made with a solid block of Temper material foam and a polyester knit cover. But what makes it stand out is its dual-sided design. The foam core is molded so that one side is flat and the other side is contoured. This gives you the option for two different experiences in just one pillow. Overall, I thought the Temper Symphony had a pretty medium firmness. The foam is fairly soft and adaptable, but still provides sturdy support. You definitely get some of that cozy contouring that the memory foam is known for here. After testing it out in all three sleeping positions, I thought the Temper Symphony worked well for back and side sleepers, but not so much for stomach sleepers. 
Tempur-Pedic recommended the arch side for back sleepers, but I actually thought both sides were pretty comfortable for lying on my back. And they recommended the flat side for side sleepers, but honestly, I liked the arch side better because it provided a little extra lift for my head and neck to stay aligned. However, I like that this dual-sided design lets you try two different styles very easily, so I think this is an especially great pillow for side-back combo sleepers. Now, like the other two pillows we've discussed, the Temper Symphony isn't going to be a great choice for hot sleepers because of the memory foam. And although Tempur-Pedic recommended the flat side for stomach sleepers, personally, I found it to be too lofty. Now, right now, the Temper Symphony costs $119 for the standard size. Now, onto the Temper Cloud adjustable pillow. This pillow, like the others, has a polyester knit cover, but its fill is where things really differ. Instead of a solid block of memory foam, the Temper Cloud adjustable pillow is filled with shredded memory foam. There are three different types of shredded foam included, one for pressure relief, one that's breathable, and one with a higher density to provide support. And this shredded foam fill is what makes the Temper Cloud adjustable pillow adjustable, as you can remove foam fill to lower the loft of the pillow to your desired height. Shredded foam also makes this pillow a little more breathable than the others I've discussed, as it allows air to flow more freely throughout the pillow. I found the Temper Cloud adjustable pillow to have a medium firmness, and in testing it, I thought it was comfortable for both back and side sleepers. I think it could potentially work for stomach sleepers, but I think you would end up removing so much of the fill to get a low loft that it's probably not worthwhile. Additionally, if you're the kind of person who likes things to be ready to use right out of the box, you might not love having to test removing and adding fill to get the loft to the right height for you. Also, removing shredded foam fill can get a little bit messy. <laughs> now, finally, the Temper Cloud Adjustable Pillow currently costs $69. And finally, let's talk about the Temper Cloud Breeze Dual Cooling Pillow, the longest name of all five. This pillow has a cotton cover and is also made with a temper material core, but also features a Temper Breeze gel pad on each side of the pillow. The gel is cool to the touch and helps to draw heat away from your body. I found this cooling gel to be really effective when I tested it out. Not only does it feel cold when you touch it, but it stays quite cool even after laying on it for a little while. This is definitely a great choice for hot sleepers. Overall, I thought the pillow had a firmness somewhere between medium and firm. It feels pretty firm at first, but the longer you lay on it, the more you sink into the foam and you end up sinking in quite deeply. So it's definitely not as firm as the temper neck, but still firmer than the symphony or the cloud. I found it to be quite comfortable for side sleepers and back sleepers, but not so much for stomach sleepers. I think it's too firm and too lofty to be comfortable for stomach sleeping. Currently, the Temper Cloud Breeze costs $189 for a queen size and $229 for a king size. Okay, now that we've had a quick overview of all five of these Tempur-Pedic pillows, let's go over which ones are gonna be best for different groups of people. So starting off with the best Tempur-Pedic pillow for back sleepers. Now, honestly, all five of these pillows can work well for back sleepers, but if I had to pick the one I like the best, it would be the Temper Cloud. The firmness and the loft are just right for back sleeping, and that's coming from a back sleeper. <laughs> now onto side sleepers. So kind of like back sleepers, all of these pillows can work well for side sleepers, but the one that I thought was the best was the Temper Neck. That really firm feel and the ergonomic design just work really well to keep the head and neck in line with the spine. All right, now let's talk about the best Tempur-Pedic pillow for stomach sleepers. Now, to be honest guys, the options are not that great here for stomach sleepers, but I did find the Temper Cloud to be pretty comfortable for sleeping on my stomach. So if you really want a Tempur-Pedic pillow and you are a stomach sleeper, that is the one that I would go with. Next up, let's talk about the best pillow for hot sleepers. Now, I think the choice is pretty obvious here, but it's the Temper Cloud Breeze Dual Cooling Pillow, also the longest name. This is definitely the coolest out of all five of these pillows, and honestly, one of the better cooling pillows that I've personally tested. Finally, let's talk about the best Tempur-Pedic pillow for budget shoppers. Now, currently priced at $69, the Temper Cloud Adjustable is the least expensive of these five pillows, so that is definitely my pick for the best budget option out of these five. I also think it's a good option for budget shoppers since it is adjustable and you can customize it to fit you exactly. You can be a little bit more assured in your purchase with that pillow. All right, before we wrap up this video, let's go over some frequently asked questions about Tempur-Pedic pillows. So our first question is, is a Tempur-Pedic pillow worth it? Now, as always, this depends on a lot of things like your sleeping position, your personal comfort preferences, and your budget. 
Now I'll say, I think if you like a memory foam pillow and you pick one that fits your sleeping position, these pillows are definitely worthwhile. But if you're someone who likes a more of a down feel or a down alternative feel, something really soft and fluffy, these Tempur-Pedic pillows might not be worth it for you. All right, let's look at our second question. Can Tempur-Pedic pillows be washed? So short answer, no, none of these pillows have a washable core, but all of them have a removable and washable cover. So you can take those off and throw them in the washing machine, but the inner core, the memory foam, cannot be washed. It can only be spot cleaned. So if you want a pillow that can be washed in its entirety, that's something to think about. And for our final question, how long does it take to break in a Tempur-Pedic pillow? Now, if you get your Tempur-Pedic pillow and it's feeling a little stiff or it's just not feeling comfortable yet, give it a couple weeks. It can actually take a little bit of time for your body to adjust to a new pillow, especially if it's a really different material than your previous pillow. So give it a little bit of time and you might find it more comfortable, but if it's still feeling a little stiff, you can actually expose it to a little bit of warmth and that'll help make the memory foam a little bit more pliable. So you could try setting it out in the sun or something like that, but don't do anything crazy like trying to put it in the microwave or anything like that. <laughs> Well folks, that's it for this Tempur-Pedic pillow roundup. Don't forget that I've reviewed each one of these pillows individually, so if you wanna take a look at those, you can find them here on our YouTube channel or you can find the in-depth written version over at sleepopolis.com. Or if Tempur-Pedic pillows just aren't for you, we have reviewed a ton more pillows that you can take a look at. I hope you found this helpful and thanks for joining me and I'll see you next time. Bye.